what's going on y'all it took me a minute ah, to get this sephora haul up tomorrow the sale ends and i just really want to get it up y'all i got a box i got a bag so i'm just gonna you know go ahead on and, and open this box up real quick and we're gonna get this <laughs> y'all what's going on y'all y'all know it's sephora time i had to go in store i made the run in store one time because you know how you be sitting there watching them damn videos <laughs> other people how and I, I had to cut myself off from that because i placed another order last night and this desi 1016 fought here on the youtube yeah discussing certain stuff and i found myself placing another order so I, ain't, I don't have this stuff in any order. I don't. So we're just going to open it. I'm going to share it with you guys. And if you see something that you really need, then get it. Why the sale going on? Because I'm not ordering from Sephora again, Lord, help me, to the end of the year at the last sale. I only try to order twice a year. Other than that, I'll just wait. I don't care how bad I want it. I'll just wait because I got a whole room dedicated to all this makeup, and that's enough. But anyway. Let's get into this Sephora haul, y'all. Y'all know Amika Dream Routine. They must have stuck this in here. This was one of the things, y'all, that I saw that somebody else had hauled and they sent me in store to get it. And these, oh, wait, 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 wait. Let me stop, y'all. Let me stop. I didn't get this during the sale, but I put this up here so I can remind you guys. Y'all, I got this sent over to me from uh Marad. This is a new sunscreen, girl. I'm going to do a little short, funny looking short on it. But look what it look like. And look what it look like on your skin. Man, it's got vitamin C in it, anti-aging products. Girl, look at that. I mean, glistening, but not oily. I got it on my face now. I'm like, okay. I ordered another one of these. This would made me place another order because I wanted to go ahead and get this while the sale was on. And I just had to, you know, share this with y'all. One thing that I could speak on that's really, really good. This is good. This, come on, camera. Why, why are you playing with me? Why are you playing with me? Come on. Okay. Can y'all see it? I want to bring it up so y'all can. There we go. The camera acting crazy. I'm sorry, y'all. It's doing its own thing. But y'all, you need this. You need this. It don't smell like anything. It's not oily, but it's, I don't know. I don't know what it does. But when I put it on my face, my face feels so soft. I, I don't know. I've never seen anything like it. But I had to tell y'all about that. Now, these two things, I don't know if y'all saw this. Cause I had to order two more of these. They came back in stock. These are the little Sephora uh, eyeshadows. Girl, I got um, what shade is this? Y'all know I can't see. Uh, emerald, I guess. It says emerald. That's what emerald looks like. Let me scoot up I'm too far back, y'all. Now. My hair is so big, I was trying to get in the frame. But this is what Emerald looks like. And I'm going to swatch this for y'all. I don't know what's going on with folks in these videos. And I want to open up and swatch stuff. I was kind of mad watching these videos. But I ordered the... uh, Yeah, there we go. I can use this green with another palette I bought that I'm going to show y'all. And this is the Sephora collection. These single eyeshadows. This one is in glaze donut. And I thought this was so pretty. Oh, oh it fell out. Oh, it's just in the little tin like uh, the MAC shadows. Oh, that's great. I can put that in one of my MAC pans. I'll figure that out later. But I want to swatch it for y'all. That's glaze donut. That's so pretty. Yeah, I see it. That is pretty. Oh, that's pretty. That's a lot of little shimmer. Not too much, not glittery, but just the nice little shimmer. And I want to put it. Let me see if I got it. Yeah, this video is going to be long because we're talking about makeup and I love me some makeup. I want it to go like right here. For my. Yes, honey. Yes. Yes. 
Yeah, it's from my little brother on highlight. Y'all see that? I like this color. Glaze Donut, what it is, if y'all can find it in stock, I suggest y'all get it. It's cute. Okay, I put a little bit too much, but y'all get the gist. Y'all get the gist. This, okay, let me stop. I'm going to try not to talk on everything, okay? And then I got uh, the Youth to the People. I had to get this. The uh, uh, Superberry Firm and Glow Dream Body Butter. Watching people on YouTube and it went out of stock. It just came back in the stock yesterday, but it was out of stock when I had to drive in town about an hour to the local Sephora. But when I saw somebody use this, I was like, ooh, I gotta get this. This is, and this is a heavy, heavy glass jar. I don't know what's going on. Why is it, you know, just focusing on me? Did y'all see what it looked like? Okay. And I left myself ashy, for real, on my arms, just so I could show y'all when she did that video. And she took this little stuff and wiped it on her hand, not her arm, just her hand, y'all. Oh, my goodness. And she might have been slick ashy on purpose, too. But watch this, y'all. When I tell you the shine was real, I was like, girl, I got to have this in my life for summertime. Look at that. That shine is real. Girl, look at that glistening, glistening. And that's just the oil. Girl, I mean, the, the, it's got to have some kind of oil in it. It's got to. But it looked like I put some kind of um loose or liquid oil on there and it's just this body butter it don't smell like anything it smell like something at a spa or something no no sweet smell no but it's it's glistening yeah i'll show y'all this other uh ash on just so y'all can see look at that can y'all tell this arm glistening. This one here, you know, it's a little ashy. It's a little ashy. Not much, but it, it's ashy. <laughs> but yeah, this was, I had to get this. I had to get this. Especially why it's on sale, because it's like $48. So with the sale, I was definitely going to get it. And the next thing I got while I'm opening the box is uh, this Nicinamide Superfood uh, Body Cleanser. Those are the two things that I went in store. Well, I ordered online and I went in store to pick up. This is a superfood and I sent them out. Did I say that already? Elevated Relief. Can I see that? Balance and soften, formulated with superfood extracts, plant derived surfactants, and nicinamide. Okay. All right. Okay. Oh, this got an earthy scent to it. I might as well put this top on there because, baby, you're going in my shower. Okay, that's a pretty big jar. That's what it looks like. And I always get the St. Bart's and the St. Bart's body scrub. But I got backups of that from the last sale. And when I saw this, I was like, okay, I'm not going to get it this time. I got enough St. Bart's. I really want to try this. And I'm happy I did. I like the smell of this. This smells like, it smells like something herbal. I can just smell the earthy, woody. It, I like this. I like the smell of this and this can be unisex the way it smells because it's not real girly but yeah the niacinamide I need for my skin I don't I don't need to be looking my age I want it to look like I'm still 27 okay let's keep moving on y'all I done did a lot of talking and we ain't even really opened much I just been running my dang on mouth and y'all know I can do that uh then I got um, the repurchase. These, this is a repurchase. The Moroccan Isle Color Care. Even though I haven't colored my hair um, in a while. Probably why I got a little growth growth going on. But uh, yeah. I got the conditioner and the shampoo. I bought these back in this time last year at the Sephora sale. And I had to get them again. Because I didn't want to buy the $88 uh, Nutrafol shampoo conditioner. 
and the pills, which they were great. Y'all saw my hair. If y'all been on my videos, I got a little taint of hair in there, y'all. You know, it ain't thickening up, but it's, it was lengthening, so I just stopped using that. And I want to keep using this Moroccan oil because I love the way these shampoo and this conditioner smell, so I repurchased it. I'm still talking and saying I'm not going to talk, right? I'm working on it. Jesus be offense. Okay, y'all. I always get these and I had to get two. Did y'all? Okay, I noticed a lot of y'all are purchasing the Sephora. It's $3.50. Yeah, they way cheaper. I get it. I tried them. They okay, but they don't meet these cotton pads. And I wish I could find these in a, um, what did y'all tell me? Somebody told me they was in a Macy, I mean a the little stores, like a TJ Maxx or something, but I've never seen them. And baby, these things are went up to $16 now. They used to be 12 so I definitely got two of them doing the sale. Cause, whew, I might be about to jump on the Sephora, but, but I love these. I just, I love these. I don't know if it's because it's real cotton or I just love the Shiseido wipes. And if you're going to get some, you better get them now because it's $16 and that little 20% off will help you if you rude. Or the 10%. Don't even bother going to get the Sephora brand because they do the same thing. I just like how soft they are. I'm talking again. Let's get in this box. Let's get in this box. Okay, guys. The first thing I got here, and this stuff is not going to be in any order. It's just it's just here, okay? Um, I got the Cherry uh, Ambition Perfume by The Seven Virtues. I didn't get a lot of perfume. Oh, yeah, let me share. Drop these jewels here with y'all because I don't know if you've heard of uh, House of Siage, the cupcake perfumes. Y'all, they having a sale. I was able to get one temptation for, I mean, I think it was uh, something temptation. Oh, I can't. Whispers of Temptation. I think that's what I got. And I got one of the Gryffindors. They 70% off, 60% off. So the House of Siage got my coins on a perfume. But this Cherry Ambition has been on my list to get for a while so I finally got it I finally got it I think the last sale I saw somebody I'm gonna open it up backwards I saw somebody talking about this and I had to get it I had it and it's not that expensive I think it was like 88 90 $88 and then you get the 20% off of that so but now I gotta smell this I'm gonna put it over here where the oil is Oh, see, I was doing my best not to spend that money, money on that Tom Ford cherry because that was just insane. I may get it, but this smells like a cherry. It smells like a real cherry, just a cherry, cherry. No, I wonder what are the notes in this? Uh, cherry ambition. Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't have all my glasses, and then if I, I could, I did, I couldn't see it. I don't know. Let's see. Oh, uh, saffron. Uh, glutam. Here, I'm going to put this up here because I can't see it. Maybe y'all can see it better than I can. Those are the notes. Okay. Oh, it's got vanilla in it, too. Okay. All right. I like it. I like it, but the cherry is really strong in here. So, oh, and the top is magnetized, or just heavy, one of the two. But yeah, seven virtues cherry. And then, guys, I got um, the rinse-free hand cleanser. Oh, this is the hand sanitizer by Moroccan Oil. That little uh, Touchland thing is cute. But I needed the real deal. And this is not expensive. This little bitty one is like $6. But it's a, there's a huge. Oops. There's a big huge one. That's like. And I sent this stuff everywhere. Didn't I y'all. <laughs> Put the cap on. Y'all see how it kind of leaked. But yeah. It don't dry out your hands. And uh. It's got a little alcohol smell. But it's like washing your hands clean I put too much way too much I saw it kind of I squeezed it too hard but I think I want to get another one of these before the sales ends and just put it in your purse it's not gritty it's not sticky so yeah I'm happy let's get another box 
open. Give me a minute, y'all. Let me cut this box open. There y'all. Okay, I got some samples in this box. Look like something from Dermatologica and Necessary Hand Lotion. Okay, we ain't gonna hear no there. Thank you for that. But anyway, I got, oh, this is why I don't have any lip color. This, when I saw this, y'all, it's that bright pink from uh, Give Cosmetics. It's the Dewy Plump Collagen Lip Gel. And it's in Peony. Y'all, when I saw this on Sephora site with that, uh, you look at it. It's a, little, it's a little black girl on there with this blue blaze girl. I'm like, I got to get that with a brown liner, which is why I got on a brown liner and just some lip oil. Because, baby, I was, look at this. Look how pretty it is. I know somebody saying, girl, that is pink, pink. I know. Y'all got to see the vision with a brown liner. And it's not that pink pink. But can you see that blue blaze, blue base in it? Girl, I knew this was going to be good on these two coolers right here. See? You just look all that bright pink. You don't see it. Oh, and this baby thick too. Oh, she thick. Mm-hmm. Now that's going to, did I tell it's going to be cute? You see that pink and I got on that brown lip liner? Man, I'm telling y'all, I knew this, this I had my eye on. Because you can see that little bit of blue in the back of it. I knew this was going to be a winner. Win, win, baby. Win, win. These big old soup coolers going to be juicy all summer long with this right here. I almost want to order another one because I knew this was going to be the bomb. Okay, let's keep moving. Let's keep moving. I got a rebuy, a repurchase, a repurchase. Y'all know this is my absolute favorite, favorite foundation. I get this every sale. This is the uh, NARS uh, Soft Matte Complete Foundation. And mine is in uh, medium deep, medium deep. I use this on my face today. I sure did. And then I put it back in the box so it would be cute for y'all. But yes, this is my favorite favorite foundation um i got the hourglass vanishing concealer in doom 7.5 and i know this looks like it looks really light really light but then i got the one in teak that i think is my color but i wasn't for sure so when I'm not sure about something, I'll get two. And one will be kind of dark, like a uh, teak, you see? Which, see how it looks just skin tone? And if I want to lighten it up, I'm hoping Doom will be the perfect thing to mix with it to give me a highlight. You see how teak is just my color? But I think Doom mixed with it will be a perfect, perfect color. These here are YouTube influences because I love Hourglass. Um, not so much the eyeshadows because, yeah, that's going to be just right mixed together. Just right, I believe. Yeah, that's a good color. Yes, yes. Look at there. Under my eyes. Just under my eyes. That's, those two going to be good mixed together. And it, they were so many sold out. So I pieced together what I could. But as I was saying, I love Hourglass. Uh, not so much the, the eyeshadows or the face products. Because they don't really make them deep enough for my skin tone. You know? But their products are good. Because this is... I've been buying this since it very first came out. This is the Hourglass um, Primer. What is it called? The Vanish Hourglass, uh, wait a minute. Vanish Airbrush Primer Base. That's what it is. This stuff here, it feels so good on your skin. If You know what? This SPF feels like this Hourglass Primer. When I tell you, when you put it on, it's so smooth. All your 
your it fills in your crevices like those big holes and, and texture you got on your face this just smooths it out and i will forever ever purchase this i will forever purchase this hourglass primer because baby <laughs> you need this if you have not tried it, tried it, and then come back here and tell me about it. Girl, I thought I had baby booty skin. That's what you're going to be telling me. That's what you're going to be telling me. Okay, the next thing I got here is uh, Patrick Ta. Now, this was <sighs> watching too many darn videos. I tried not to do all that order and watch other folk videos, but when I saw this color, it's so pretty. Oh, I didn't show y'all the box. This is the box. I got into opening my stuff. In my own word, this is two cc's, two cc's, and this is what it looks like. And this is what is it called? Patrick Ta. Yeah, I can't see with plumping. Oh, it's a plumping gloss. Major volume, major volume pumping, plumping gloss. That's what it says. Let's swatch this over here. And see what that two cc's look like. Oh, it looks like it's just a clear gloss. I'm gonna put it on top of it. I just had to try it and see if it stings or does anything. I can't really tell y'all. I put so much of the other one on, I can't tell. But I thought that was a nice neutral color for the summer. Okay, so I picked that up. And the last thing throw away all of these packages so I don't have to throw that away later our last thing in that box is this salt and stone now this this box again from watching the videos and everybody was talking about the salt and stone okay but I did not get the body wash because I didn't have a flavor, I mean a, a scent that I like. Until I saw Neroli and Basil. I absolutely love Neroli. Sephora used to have a scent called uh, Ragabone. I mean it's company or perfume, whatever it was, the company was Ragabone and they sold Neroli. But they don't sell it anymore and I, that's when I found out I am a fan of Neroli. So when I saw this... Um, deodorant what it is it's aluminum free deodorant and it has dang near five stars don't if it's not five it's four and a half or almost, i think it was five now but take a look for yourself oh my god this smells so good you can smell the basil you can smell the neroli and and i and all the reviews said this stuff was good it lasts all day so if that's the case this is going to be my new new. I have tried a lot of aluminum free deodorants on Sephora. And all was a fail. Y'all, this smells so good. I cannot stop smelling it. I just can't stop smelling it. I remember it had all good reviews. This smells entirely good. So good. And only comment I think somebody said was that they got white on their clothes or something. But okay. All right. All right, put your deodorant on first and let it dry. Then put your clothes on if that's what you're getting. Because you smell this good, baby. I'm wearing this. This smells good. If you can get into a Sephora, look for this um, Neroli and Basil aluminum-free deodorant and give it a try by salt and stone. Give it a whiff. You're going to come home with that. And i let you guys know, you know, how it holds up. Just ask me in the comments. And y'all know I love to be down in the comments talking all the time. I will respond. And I will tell you. That smells so good. So good. Okay. Last box, y'all. Last box. I'm sorry for all this talking, but for those of you who have been here for a while, y'all know I like to talk. <laughs> y'all know I like to talk. Oh, did I tell y'all? I passed my nurse practitioner certification board. So your girl is now a nurse practitioner. Yay! Took me 25 years of nursing to do it, but I, I went ahead and done it. <laughs> okay, y'all, last box, last box. Let's see. Oh, I have never tried this. Have any of y'all ever tried this? The Yummy Skin uh, Serum Tint. I've never tried this, but they put a, a sample. I guess I'll give it a try. But my, I just always felt like my skin was too oily. Hmm. 
Okay, and I never click on them bubbles. But anyway, let's let's go. Let's go. Y'all, I really was not in my mind trying to get caught up in all this stuff that everybody else was getting. So um uh, this box is my first order, and this is everything that I ordered that I wanted initially, that I wanted, not that somebody else would get. And of course, I had to get this. I bought this during Christmas, and I fell in love with it, and I had to get the bigger one. You know, they had the Fenty Beauty, the three sets, and uh, the one that I loved the most was the Cinnamon, what was it? Y'all, I can't, I should have bought my readers in here with me. But this is the one that smells like cinnamons. Girl, that's why I didn't get a refill. Cause Oh, it smells like cinnamon buns. I just love the smell. Y'all can't smell, can you? Damn it. <laughs> but this is what it looks like. And it's on sale. It's on sale too. On It's on sale. I think it was $32. And then you get the 20% off or whatever percentage you are. You get that percent off of the on sale price. So this is another one I might order another one of. Because this baby here. Well I'm glistening on here. But let me put this one on this other arm. Even though I got one open. I'm going to put this one over here. Man the glistening be real. I'm going to be a glow ball all summer long. All summer long. Look at her. That just make you glisten. And this. Oh, and this one smells so good. This one smells so good. I'm going to say this one though. And I'm going to use up the use to the people. Because this here is like my sexy moment kind of uh, body cream. <laughs> okay. Okay. It's on sale, y'all. You better get it there if you want it. And then um, Paula's Choice came out with this um, Mandelic Acid, 6% uh, Mandelic Acid, and 2% Lactic Acid. It's a liquid exfoliant. You know, she has that black bottle that's been out for a while, right? But this one, why are you being so difficult over here? Okay, there we go. All right. Now, what it's supposed to do is improve sun damage, dullness, and fine lines. And uh, reverses what y'all say, compromised skin barrier, and gentle and effective for all skin types. Okay, like the one in the black one is more for people with eye problems with pimples and acne, you know, concerns like that. But this one is for my concerns, which addresses those fine lines and skin discolorations. So the medallic acid, we're going to see y'all. Pay attention to my little skin when I be popping in here without my good face on. And if you start to see it clearing up and looking better, knowing this is the only thing that I add. Now, I will say this bottle is not as fat as I thought it would be. I thought it would be about the size of the dark spot removal by Ole Hendrix, but no, it's not. It's, 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 it's you know... It costs a little money, but it's a little small. So maybe we'll see how well it works. If I buy it again, you know it worked real good. But yeah, we're going to see. Okay, we're getting to the makeup, y'all. We're getting to the makeup. This is so cute. I bought these. I think they ran out of stock real quick. But these, these little butterfly beauty sponges by uh, Sephora. Y'all know Savoir brand stuff was on sale. I wish I had got two already. And uh, last year it was the strawberry ones. Oh, shoot. I should have got two. They are really soft. Just like the strawberry ones. They feel like the real beauty blenders. You know how you get some sponges and they be like a brick even after you wet them? These, uh, I guess there's no point in talking about them because they might come back. For whatever reason, the camera cut off. These might come back in stock. If they do, grab them. But they all gone now. So, sorry. I couldn't get this video up any faster because I was waiting on boxes. And if I hadn't did all that ordering. Okay, that's neither here nor there. Let's keep going. Now, the next thing I got was I had to reorder my brush smashed. I had to reorder me another number 50 brush. I love this brush. And the only thing I don't like about it is it's always dirty. So, <clears throat> yeah, it's the brush fault. I know. 
I know it's my fault but if I, I figured if I got another one I could have a backup so I ain't got to get up and wash that brush right then and right there yeah, there we go yeah this is the number 50 it's my little powder brush yes I love love Sephora brushes and they 30% off y'all see they dirtier than this if it's this dirty I know what the old one looking like already don't you you, you already know don't you <laughs> But yeah, this is a good all-over powder brush you use for a blush brush. I love it. 20% off. I mean, 30% off that. Okay, yeah? All right. Now, we all the way down to the last few items, which is just makeup. I did get a lot of uh, Sephora brand stuff. Like, I got these two lipsticks. Let me get it open. Uh, I can't see the name of that. See, I can't tell you. But I can show you the color. And you probably could look on there and see these were on sale for five dollars. The colors on the caps. Did y'all notice that? I didn't notice that. One is a deep dark purple, and the other one is light. Y'all, I'm thinking summertime. Okay. All right. Ooh. Look at that. Ain't that pretty? That's a pretty purple. Let's watch it. Oh yeah, that's pretty. Ooh, these so cool as can be. Ooh. Okay, 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 okay. That's pretty. Ooh, that's pretty. What's my secret? And I don't know. I wish I could see the name. That, that it's just too small. And this is the this one. Baby, yeah, you are gonna be my winter time, babe. Yes. I wish I could see the name, but I can't. But get a good look at the colors. Maybe you can see them on um, Sephora by just looking at the colors. You know, it ain't that many. And, and I'm hoping. I'm sorry, guys. I wish I could see it to give y'all the accurate name of it. Got this blush, uh, number 17. It says Jealousy. Ooh, okay. I guess I should have looked at the name. But I really wasn't caring about the name. It was the price that had me like, okay. I'm definitely gonna pick up pick up this blush. 30% off Sephora brand, right? Ooh, that's a pretty pink. I don't know if we can use this or if we if we use it. Let me see. I'm gonna have to swatch it. Girl, I'm gonna be pinky pinky glistening, glistening all summer long. Y'all see that? That is so pretty. I was looking for a brush. And I always have brushes up here. But not, to, you know what? This is my wig brush. I hate to put blush on it, but I'm fin to because I want to see what this going to look like. Oh, yes. That's, that's definitely a color girl pink. It's got the anything with a blue base I'm on it. Okay. All right. I already had on a pink, so you really can't tell. If y'all could tell what it did, I hope that helped. But yeah, this is the Sephora. Don't be looking down at all that mess. But yeah, <laughs> this is the Sephora. Did I tell you what color? Jealousy, number 12, and hey, Jealousy. Okay. All right. All right, girl. And then I got two Sephora mascaras. This is a Love the Lift uh, Waterproof. And then this one is Love the Lift. What's the difference? Love the Lift Ultra Black. I guess uh, Instant Curl Lifting. So I guess one of them is waterproof and super black. And the other one is, girl, I don't know. This one says Ultra Black. So I guess one of them is waterproof and one of them is not. So yeah. I open one y'all so I can show y'all what the the doe foot looks like oh shoots yeah I got all this lotion on my hand I can't get in it my hand is slipping I really want to show y'all what the do it the old fashioned way okay I can't get in it <laughs> I couldn't even bite it oh 
Now maybe I can get, yeah, I know them teeth, you generally work. Okay, that's what the applicator looks like. Okay. Love the lift. I got on lashes, so I really can't tell, but I like the applicator. Okay, so when I'm, this one is just waterproof, I'm thinking. And this one is, both of them say ultra black, so it's got to be waterproof and not waterproof, but we'll see. I'm probably going to use both of them at the same time anyway, so yeah. Okay, the next thing I got here, y'all, did y'all see this? Sephora came out with their own highlighters. I got number 02. That's what it looks like. Colorful Luminizer. And this is 02 in Sparkling Honey. And baby, when I last looked, these were sold out. Because I wanted to get that really cute bronze one. And I'm thinking, ain't nobody going to be checking for Sephora. So when I make my second order, I can come back and get that. And um, it was gone by Saturday. So they may have came back in stock. Because they've been bringing a lot of stuff back in stock. This is what it looks like. That's cute, cute. And this says Luminizer, Illuminator Sparkling Honey. Feels like a baked formula. I'll put it, let's put it right here. Ooh, y'all see that? Girl, wait a minute. Come on, brush. Look at this. Here go a brush. I don't wear these highlights. I got this for my eyes right there. But, ooh. Oh, but I'm put a little bit on y'all. Oh, okay. Don't use no dense brush if you decide to highlight with this. Make sure you use a little fluffy brush, cause this little baby here. Y'all see it? Got a little shimmer. Got a little shimmer. I'm gonna be using it. You know. I don't know why I want to go back to this. This is something I used to do all the time, which was high highlight my look. You know, I'm going back to that. These are pretty good. That's that's a lot of shimmer. Look at her. That's my great grandson, y'all. Yeah, he in the, he in the video. Okay, anyway, but that's it. Y'all see it right there. All right, again, that's uh, sparkling honey. All right, let's see. And then, yeah, this should be the last Sephora collection thing that I have. It is. I went ham on the Sephora collection, 30% off. I took advantage. They offered it, and I said, okay. All right? What I supposed to say? No, I don't want that. Or, no, nah, you can keep your 30% out. No, I said, okay. But this is the new bronzer that Sephora released. I never did get a chance to try the old one. So... Oh, that's chocolate. I got the shade. What shade did I get? Uh, oh, Coconut Retreat. That's what it says. Coconut Retreat. That's what it looks like. And that's what it says on the back. Coconut Retreat. But it, it, it's darker. Can y'all tell back here? That it's darker than what it looks like with all the lights. That's the true color. Coconut Retreat. And uh, we're going to go with my wig brush again just to see. I don't really see. But I do got on a face full of stuff. I think this will work great as a bronzer for me. Because I always get mine too dark. And I was worried I had did it again. I think this time. Instead of having contour on top of contour. I'm going to actually be able to bronze. So yeah. And then I got 30% off of it. So. <clears throat> okay. I just got a few more things to go. I really want to try the Fenty. Um, new concealer. And I got mine in 40 in. <clears throat> I got some of that dust in my throat. <laughs> I'm going to get into this. I don't know if I got it too dark. But if I did. Another reason I was going with light colors. <clears throat> I'm going to give me a drink of water. 
Oh yeah, I don't think I got it too dark. It look like it's my skin tone. Have y'all tried these? You know, Fenty had been doing a little hit and missing. That look like my exact skin color. Oh, I did good with that. Look at there. Oh, and that feels smooth. Have y'all tried these? And nobody sent me an inbox to get it? Okay, I just waited on the bus, y'all, for the sale. Then I was going to get it, but it disappeared. Okay, I'm glad I got this. I can't wait to use because, y'all, I got these dry under eyes. It's supposed to be super moisturizing. I should have tried this, but the sale was here. Okay, I didn't buy any more concealers. How about that? Okay, the next thing I got, guys, is this. I always get these. Oh, but I gift them. I get them, and it may be a big pack, and I gift them to anybody I run into. I got an extra one. Oh, yeah. What's that? I got lips. Uh, it's supposed to be a lip sleeping mask, but girl, it's cold out here. Oh, girl, it's so dry. Just put some of them. Look here, I got an extra one in my purse. And I end up gifting them away and never trying them. But I saw it was a new shade, and I can't. Can I see it? I know this is a new one that I never had. So instead of buying a whole one, because this equals up to about a whole one right here, and I can have them in every purse instead of just one jar. But uh, what is this? I don't know what this new shade is. But I saw it on the packaging, and I wanted to get it. The one at the bottom is the new one. That one right there. But I can't see it. If y'all can see it, then y'all know the name of it, because I don't know. But I wanted it because I knew it was new. And I think I've had this one. But yeah. Anyway, this is just me, and I buy these every time I see them. And I just might buy another one, because I use this lip mask every night. I don't want them old, old lips. I don't want my lips to look like they're older than me or my age. That's all I'm saying. I need them to be stay big, juicy, and full like they've been all my life. Okay? Alright, the next thing I have here, guys, is... Oh, how did I get so many glosses? This is a Huda Beauty... Oh, oh, it's not a gloss. It's the Huda Beauty Corrector. Yes! I saw this and it, it said Blood Orange. And it looked like it was going to be that really, really good dark orange for, you know, covering up my spots and dots. Because I got um, the Tinted one. Is it by Tinted? Is that the right makeup? And I got one by, um, y'all know the cheap one in the squeeze too. When we used to use all those concealers for them. LA Girl? Is that what it is? I can't think of the name of it. Might not be LA Girl. Might be a company like LA Girl. Y'all know what I'm talking about? And I got the Bobby Brown. But... They ain't that dark, dark orange I'm looking for. But this blood orange, baby. See, this is how the tinted one looks. By the company tinted in the little stick. But it don't come out. Girl, this is the one. Look at her. Now, this is what I'm looking for. To color and blacken out all of those darks. I'm so glad I got this. I almost took it out. Look at that. This is what I needed. This right here, baby. Let me get the one that I got that I'm trying to tell you and compare it to the Bobby Brown. Give me one minute right back. Okay, guys. I grabbed them all. This is the uh, LA Pro. See how red it is? I'm going to put it next to the Hue to Beauty. You see that? This is an awkward position. Okay, see how that's not really orange, orange? It, it ain't doing what I needed to do. This is the one by Tinted. Is it Live Beauty? Or I think it's Live, but it's Tinted. And this is, see how red it look in there? Like it's really that orange, orange. But when I swatch it, it's close. It's close to that Hue to Beauty, but because it's a cream, it don't keep that red color. It... It ain't doing it. It's what I got on my face today. And then the Bobby Brown one. This is the Bobby Brown one. Y'all can tell I've been on the search for this, right? That's it. I'm going to swatch it right next to the Live Beauty. And it's more on the line with the LA Girl. So, to me, 
the tint it looked like it's really good but y'all i'm telling y'all it don't do that when it's on my face it just kind of shears out but this one right here this 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 who the beauty one i think it's gonna do what it need to do because it's girl i'm, I'm doing this when y'all see me and uh, none of my spots and dots, ain't none of them showing, none of them. No, it's this Huda the, Huda the Beauty. I'm glad I got this. I am so glad I got this. My little dark eyes, they're going to be bright as bright. You're like, girl, your skin looks so good. Uh-uh, baby, it's the undercarriage of this makeup. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. Sorry, I just had to show y'all that. We only got uh, four more things. I got this milk. I went on a gloss kick. I usually don't do that because I got so many glosses, but... I did, but I got the milk makeup. I had this in my cart the last sale and it sold out, so I just waited to this sale to get it. Those milk makeup lippies, and yes, this is the season for the pinks for me. Like it is, it is. Look at that, girl. Y'all gotta see the vision. Y'all gotta see the vision. A dark brown eyeliner, baby. Let me swap it right there. Oh, and that's a pink pink, too. Look at her. But it ain't all that pink. I'm, yeah, I'm finna put some on. All right, girl. Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah, it'll, it'll be good to go in the middle of just my... Y'all can see it. It done washed out my blue-red, which I love. I love this. Hot pink. But this... Baby pink. That's cute too. I'm glad I got it. It's been sitting in my cart since the last sale waiting for it to come back. And I like the size of that too. Come on. There we go. And there it is on the back of my hand. Of course I got so much stuff on the back of my hand. But yeah. That's it right there. Okay. I said I want to do all that talking, y'all. Not to talk, y'all. Just about to death. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Not really, but I'm sorry. Okay. And then I got this. Uh, oh, I forgot about this. Uh, you remind me. The Jackie Ina came out with her uh, fragrance line. And I saw all four of them there. And I was like, maybe. I was like, ooh, they cheap. I think it was like $79. Maybe I should get, no, and I thought about my bad experience when I did decide to get those candles, and my candles were bad, I don't know if they were a bad batch, so I decided to just click on a baby one, and then I decided, no, nah, I'm going to get one, and they was gone, that fast, I mean, I never closed, they was all sold out, so, I got the You Remind Me one, and I got it in the little travel size, and I'm happy I did. I think it was like 24 bucks, so I'm happy I did, because if it's horrible, then I don't have to be mad at Jackie every time I pick it up saying, nah, girl, you know this shit. Okay. All right, but I'm going to spray it. I'm going to spray it and see what it smells like. Let me see. I'm going to let it. Oh, that smells good. Girl. These folks had me discouraged and thinking, oh, what have I spent my I should have got the bigger. This smells good. I don't know what they're talking about. And in the reviews, this you remind me. I don't know how it's going to last. I, maybe I like it because it's not that super fruity, cherry, sweet. It, it smells like a, a calm, a slow smell. I like it. I like it. I'll get the big bottle. When it comes back in, I will get the big bottle. Because she reminds me of something. I just don't know what. But I like it. I like it. Okay. This is the Jackie Ina. You remind me. I was trying to wait on the, on the dry down. But dang it, I should have got the big one. I really like this. I don't know the color because it don't say on here. But I know it's you remind me. I really like it. That smells nice. I, I don't mind having it. It's not blow me down, blow me away. But it is a, it's a nice smell. Okay. And the next thing I got here is uh, a forever, I mean forever. I'm lying, y'all. This is Artist Couture. All of these lipsticks are on sale. Um, And uh, I went with the sale stuff because I was trying to, you know, 
let me my let me my spinning a little taste until last night when I got the other order. But yeah, if y'all want to see the order, let me know. I order I also order from Ulta because they having a sale. And if y'all want to see a uh, a haul of that stuff, let me know. If not, don't worry about it. I understand because it's been a lot of hauls. But anyway, this is the Audit Couture Lippy in. Power print. That's what it says. And I thought this would be a real nice nude lip for the summer. That's a pretty color. And again, I think they were going to sell for $13. And then a 20% off. And I, I went for it. I went for it. I'm going to put this right here. Oh yeah, this is going to be real pretty. And it's so creamy. Yeah, that's going to be pretty for the summer. Y'all see it? Of course, with my famous brown lippy. Dang it, I'm going to go back and see what other colors they got. Because this is really... I want to, y'all. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You can't really tell because I got so much stuff on. But I can tell this color going to do... I'm, gonna, I'm going back on there at this... I'm not going back on that. I'm good. I'm going back on that. They $13 and 20% off and lipstick is high. Okay, I'm done. Let me get to the last thing in my bag. This is another the hype made me buy. It. That's what this is. And this little thing is expensive. This is the Givenchy Prism Lee Bray <laughs> Powder. I've heard so much about it. And um, what color did I get? A uh, Popoline Mimosa so much about how this powder smooths out your texture and make your face just look so and as y'all see I got a little texture a lot of texture here and there so I wanted to pick this up and see how it would you know function for me I just I just you know only for so long y'all know they've been talking about this powder for a while y'all can give me that they've been talking about this Givenchy powder for so long and, and, and I've been like, girl, I'm done falling for that hype order and that mess and get home and be looking like, ooh, my skin must be the worst. It don't work on me. When you know dang well that stuff wasn't good. People just be on the, on the let me sell something now. Let me get some money off the link. They don't be telling folks truth. They kind of make me mad. So I didn't buy it. I said a lot to say that, didn't I? But the fact that they got them in minis, and the minis high as heck too. They high as giraffe put they high too so I want to try it and I'm getting a little oily and y'all can see my little texture spots so we are gonna put some of this on but anyway it's got did I oh it smells good it's got three or four different shades in there a yellow get get in the in the thing there you go it's got three or four different shades and then when you open it up you, they all just mix together you can see it's a little bit messy, but when you put it on, it's supposed to smooth. What the heck? Did y'all see that? Oh my. Y'all see how smooth my skin is? Y'all see the bumps, the craters, the bad skin part? Y'all see that? Be looking this time. See that? I'm getting it out the top. Y'all ready? Girl, I ain't bleeding. Okay, okay. Stop. Did y'all see that? The what? Girl, I'm going back. I gotta get this big bag, the big one before the sale ends. I lied. I said I wasn't going back. I'm going back. This is poplin. This is what a prism libre girl. I gotta get the should I get another little one to make two big ones since I got the little one or just get a big one? Girl, did y'all look at my face? What the heck? Poplin? Uh, mimosa pop. Okay, I'm going to get the big one. Okay, man, y'all, come on now. Y'all know the, the hype be hard to follow. Like they hyping the heck 
makeup out of that new, um, what is it called? The new, uh, uh, hourglass powder. I bet you that powder don't do this. I bet you that pot don't do this. Did y'all see that? I can't wait to watch this video back because I'm going to edit it out if I'm tripping. But to me, man, ooh wait, I want one of them blushes now. If that powder do that, it's just smooth. It's just smooth. Yeah, I'm going to get a big one. Y'all got to go. I got to get off here so I can order before it sells out, before the sale ends. And this is all the stuff that I've purchased. I'm going to try to uh, get out of here, put this stuff up, and clean up. I'm, I'm lying. I got to get off here so I can go order that powder. I'm surprised it's still in stock. I don't know why. Look at, look at that. Okay. Okay, I hope everybody had a wonderful, blessed day. I hope y'all enjoying y'all shopping. I hope y'all enjoyed this haul. I know it's a bit long because your girl get a little long with it sometimes. Uh, y'all stay blessed, and uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys. Running to Sephora as I run. Yep, I'm running. <laughs> running right to this phone. In the